Now, pure-blooded Saiyan's hair does not change from the day we are born, with the exceptions of beards and mustaches. Oi, now I can't stop thinking about Vegeta with a mustache. Mustache. <laughs> I will attempt to do the entire video while talking like this. Hello, my name is Matt, and I have no idea what I'm doing. Voy a cantar esta canción con mucho cariño de mi corazón a la república. Periodically I'm going to flash why I'm, I'm using that voice when it comes to this because it's absolutely it, it caught my eye because Mustache. Mustache. Team Four Star and their um, their Dragon Ball Z dub, which I absolutely love and have watched a thousand times over from episode one to episode wherever they are right now. Mustache. This is funny because Vegeta just shows up with this giant bushy mustache. It's just mustache. <laughs> it just tickles me every time. But this is uh, Mustachio. It is a pistachio enhanced coffee. Um, this one uh, became, uh, this one particularly interests me for two reasons. One, I like pistachios to begin with. They're, they're tasty. And pistachio ice cream, which I'm not going to, I, I'm going to say right now, it's not going to taste like pistachio ice cream because pistachio ice cream is sweet. And these are not sweet. These are not sweetened in any way. They are just, um, when, during the roasting process, they are flavored in a specific way, and then they are ground and shipped immediately and come right to your door in just a couple of days. Let's load this up. I'm very excited for this. <clears throat> Let it breathe for a second while I get some hot water. I'm using tea kettle water that I've heated on the stove rather than using the water nuking it in the microwave. I would not think it makes a difference in my head cannon, but I want to make sure I explore every avenue and last set of videos, I, or last video I did reviewing Bones Coffee, I did it all in the microwave and you know that seemed just fine. Um, but I'm trying it in a tea kettle right now, or a, a water kettle right now, to see if that's better or worse. So far, I would say it's about the same. I'm fine with it. It's all right. Oh boy. Let's see. Oh my god! I'm sorry. I shouldn't react that way because... But I do. I react that way. It's really weird, isn't it? How when something extraordinary happens, you just like go kind of giddy for a second, regardless of who you are. That smells amazing. That is pistachio. That is sweet smelling pistachio. I'm trying not to tear up. I don't know why I'm tearing up. Maybe because I'm so surprised. Oh my God, this smells so amazing. I don't just want a little cup of this, I want all of it. Wow, I'm floored. I, I'm more floored than I was with that key lime pie coffee. I am, oh, that is spectacular. And what's so funny is when I pull it out here, you're gonna see, and no damn difference. It's the exact same, it's the exact same color. Oh boy, I'm gonna wanna make more of this when we're done. Well, I probably shouldn't. This will be coffee cup number four. It's not a full coffee cup, but still, it's, dude. It didn't kill me the last time. It probably won't kill me this time. He said his famous last words. Get this blooming. I, that, that look of shock and surprise that you just saw was about as genuine as you can get. I, that, that smells amazing. That if you like pistachios, just the smell is absolutely fascinating and wonderful. I'm because the, the key lime citrus, um, you know, it's like, ooh, citrus, mm, yeah, no, let's get a nose full of that, ooh, yeah, let's get a just squirt the lime right up my nose, that's great. That's kind of what it was when it when you when it hits you, 
Um, but something sweet and nutty like pistachio has a sp just this specific smell. You know, if you open up a bag of pistachios or if you open up a, a thing of ice cream that's pistachio, it's just there's this just smell that's just just pistachio. And I have never smelled anything that's supposed to be coffee that is that is smelled like that. It, it, it smell, it's I know it's not going to be sweet. I'm well aware of the fact that it's not going to be sweet, but that the smell was just absolute pistachio sweetness hitting you right in the nose. It just, it reminds you of the first time in your life, if you like pistachio ice cream, that you had pistachio ice cream. <laughs> it's, just, it's just, it tastes just like it smells. Um, coffee, and then you get the pistachio hit. Um, it's just like, you know, it's just like anything else, you know, with a strong, with a strong base, which is coffee. You're gonna get the coffee first, and then you're going to get the underlying current that the uh, that's was you know roasted into the coffee bean, um, and in this case it's pistachio. And it's almost sweet without having to add sweetener. I know there's no sweetener in this at all. We just watched me do the whole flippity dippity dippity doopy thing. Um, there's, I mean, but it just tastes like it's about to be sweet. It's, there's enough of a hint there that you can convince yourself that it's going to be sweet. And, um, oh my it's just, you know, and I don't know how many times I can describe it the same way, <laughs> but it's like coffee and then it's pistachio and it's, and, and you can tell it's not like, it's not like, you know, a minute later, oh, there it is. I got it, that, there it hit me, you know, or it's like, not like an aftertaste. It's a hit immediately, immediately. And you can, you can smell it because it's got an, an amaretto. Maybe when pistachios ferment a little bit, they become a little amaretto smelling. Um, I do know that pistachio ice cream has kind of an amaretto taste to it. Um, I don't know where that comes from. I, I've never looked at the back of an ice cream ingredients to figure out what I'm eating because I probably should, I prefer not to know. But yeah. Oh, that's delicious. This is the best out of all of them so far. I have one left. I'm pretty sure I know how that one's going to go because it's a salty caramel which, and mocha, which is delicious. Sounds delicious. Um, but, uh, this, I would, I head over heels, if I could do such a thing without breaking myself, would, um, recommend getting in your sample five pack, because you should start with a sample. If you're going to order anything from the Bones Coffee Company, I would start with a sample five pack, because if you get something that you think is going to be amazing and you get it and it's not like what you thought it was, you're just going to be disappointed. Um... But um, in your sample five pack, if you decide to go and, and, you know, do what I'm doing with the coffee, I would highly recommend Mustachio because it is absolutely fantastic. If you love, if, if you love pistachios, you will get a kick out of this. This is fantastic. This is I would recommend this wholeheartedly along with the maple bacon and the key lime pie to try. Um, and then they've got a couple other flavors scattered about that I think I'm going to try at some other point. But anyway, um, this uh, is amazing. I would give this, if I rated anything, a 10 out of 10. 12 out of 10. That's so stupid. Uh, the 10 out of 10. Um, Fantastic. Absolutely fantastic. I would, I cannot recommend a thing more than that. And I'm overstating it. Um, but yeah, I mean, this blew me away. Absolutely blew me away. Mustache. Try some. 
I would. I did. It's great. Thanks for tuning into this one. I got one more coming up. Thanks for watching.